Hello. Hello. Uh, so today uh, we are going to discuss some form validation kind of things. Okay. So I just wanted to know that HOC higher order component that you all understood, right? Or is there any problem? So getting uh, understanding of the HOC or last day session. Okay. If not, then we are going to move uh, towards that new chapters that is form validation so if i'm creating one react app that form validation component not react app so i'll uh, how can we do the form validation in the class based component that today's agenda and also the time permits then we will so showing other uh, demo that is higher order component and the functional component yesterday i'll do in the class based component but today I'm going to set the functional component okay so first i'm going to in, uh, introduce the form validation field that if is there any form in react so you have to validate and have to some validation kind of things we have to add over there right so that is the two this agenda i'm sharing my screen my screen is visible right hello everyone this is okay. That is one uh, simple demo form validation. One form will be created, and then if I will submit the empty form, so it will show the error. Otherwise, it will submit that data in the server. So only front end side things I will do. So first I have to input the React in the non class that is form validation extends react dot component. Export default that form validation. From state, I will take and fields. Fields are objects here. Fields that will be objects and errors. That is also objects. I will do on a view that is constructor and render. Done. That is one div I will take. Div. 
first name uh, from validation uh, that in your home validation example take one div id main registration that is id i will write the css on top of that container id is equal to register H three registration is a let simple. Now form format. Form first, I have to mention the method. This post name that is user registration form. and on submit that is the method will create on this dot submit uses the method name registration form first have to create the HTML Two or three fields I will take, and that is your label. Label name and input type text. I will do. name is equal to username hello that will be initially this dot state dot fields dot username so Not username. Username. So I have to first check it. Export default. I have to import. Import from validation from Situation that integrate of 
first form is there, right? Some placeholder you can add. Your name. And take on div. Complete the T here. So that is your first username. User name form field. Copy. Next is your hello event. One on change even I will add later. First I'll create two forms. And one error field. That is also required div div class name is equal to error message. This message I will get it this dot state dot errors dot username if any error occurs so it will display so i'll take one day something i'll to copy In that case, instead of username, this field will be email ID. Email ID. Placeholder email. Error start email ID. Email validation. Ready. Just put one class name that is for understanding that which field the the wrapper is there. So user wrapper. That is the team user wrapper. Class name that is that email wrapper. Copy. Test one is second is uh, mobile number. Is in telephone number or it's kind of things. So name. placeholder mobile number any name you can do it the state this dot state dot field dot is no no e i l e this name and the error that should be matched okay? and then what i'll do it's three fields 
नेक्स्ट फील्ड इज पासवर्ड ओके right so that your mobile number mobile number and that is your last four is password right input type password name also password let's hold on not required in that case or you can add trust is that field dot password okay Now I have four input field is there, right? I need some. Um, that is one input button. Input type submit class name is equal to button. No value we can take that is register. What I'll do? I'll create some CSS for this. You can feel is not good. I'll go style it. I've taken one register, right? Yeah, D by D register. Oh. Register, comma, and we have to create one CSS yes, with three hundred pixel border. You can take one pixel solid. That is D six on D seven on D model. You can add padding. Zero px, fifteen px, fifteen px. On border. Radius. You can add five px. On family. Radial. Any on family you can take line height. Then with sixteen pixel you can take color. On size, fourteen pixel. In background, any color you can take. In margin, that will be the auto. Or like ten pixel or two. Okay. Now I have another login. Right. Home plus login. That CSS also be there.
the code right now. Then form label form of form input that should be your display block and with to just pass with 90 percent no, only form input that is a common field form level and form input these two have properties are required now if i will individually add something in the form input that is a different padding 10 pixel or border you can add solid one pixel dd c7 and if i have one button where is the button button to ask them background color water color you can take on water color onto it bold heading and take 12 pixel 15 pixel color that will be the so App one family that is there. Now I have to click at the click event and display things. Hmm that from heritation so this is my submit format on submit this event do not bind this so i have to register this thing when point One minute.
first we'll write some on change event and the first that is the issue for right? one minute cool. change as the world is dot handle change so we'll copy and paste every form element that is common i'll create common function um, This change event pass one event and inside the event this dot handle change. Dot change dot find this. Yes. And same thing earlier it was error because I have not registered the function. So that's why it's not identified. If I will also copy this thing. If Pass is equal to this dot dot bind. You can see bind automatically not coming right when intelligence not showing. Instead of that, what I'll do? There is a two this. No, no, no. Two this can be any. Obviously, two this is there, and also you can see if I will remove this now, the function. You can see dot bind is not auto, it's coming from text. From my last search, the bind is coming, right? The method is not coming. The icon is ABC, means whatever I search or write on the random basis, one text. text, a text, it's just text, it's not method, okay. right? Then what I will do, I will create the method. Method okay. is to register in the state, right? Now you can see if I will dot. You can say method are coming, right? It's a method. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, earlier was text is coming, whatever the last search. You can say icon also be changed, the method, the function, right? So that's why earlier I got the error because I have not means create the function and write the byte over there. And then you have to pass the this. So two functions are registered and we have to write some logic. Is yeah. there double this is required or the it is a optional uh, or it's some which, by mistake it is there? Which is this one? You yeah you wrote uh, this twice. It's a by mistake uh, you wrote. By mistake? No no that is you have to register in the you are using the state right class function na? Hmm. So in your class function you have inside the constructor you have to register this thing in the functional component it does not require you just write. Uh, some function and it will be uh, coming from the alert okay or if you register the on change on click and add this event okay but in the class function if you if you are using the class based component right mm -hmm. then you have to bind your event inside mm -hmm. the constructor otherwise it cannot be identified mm -hmm. that's why i have added two things this dot submit form means my form that button event on submit event that is which is bind to this this means inside the class i have to register this bind inside the class okay the two binds is a two event one is on change handler i have taken other is submit user form two handlers i have taken right so that is the two event bind i have added so two logics i have to write over here okay and the handle change event means whenever input i have wrote some uh, value in the input this input value i'll to grab so what i'll do 
if one feels that these dot state dot fields then what i will do fields e dot target dot name is equal to e dot target dot value you understood this point right what i will do i create one fields that is this dot state dot field and here e dot target dot name whatever the name i have added na so they will assign the value e dot target dot value on the handle handle change event okay and i have to update the state this dot set state that is the update your state inside the class component and we have to add the fields submit from what i will do i will pass one event that is by default i have to prevent default means if on submit first triggers in the back end right it will automatically goes to the server side so what i will do i will prevent default that means i have to or return false means you have to block the road from the event so when you click the input button so it does not go to the server side otherwise my front end logic that will not be executed so what i will do i will make it e dot prevent fault then i will write the logic if this dot i will create other function validate form validate form i have to create right this is the validate form function I'll copy this late errors this object late form is valid is equal to true next what i will write if fields fields username this is the username that is the username i'll copy it paste it equal to false errors username is equal to I will write Kaushik yes uh, here, ng pristine, ng dirt, uh, sorry, dirty pristine, all the things is, by default is not available in React forms. Uh, by do no, it is the Angular, na, whatever you told, ng dirty. No, okay, ng, okay. That's not available. Here. No, 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 no. I think like that, like that. Is there anything in uh, React by default? We will get. No, by default here, whatever I am doing, that is, I have to create the logic and write the code over here, right? So in third-party okay. kind of things, I have not added anything. It's a many 
many widgets, many form validation example you will get. That is not the use case. But you have to know right how if the custom fields I have to validate, right? If there is custom okay. thing is there, then how we can do that, right? So that's okay. why I am not adding any um, third party thing. So okay, just create. Are trying to understand the how if we write the logic from the scratch, so how it should be okay. right. That's the reason. Okay. What is the problem? Type of fields that is your username. Hmm. Not equal to undefined. If Dollar fields just first uh, logic is more different. It takes some time. Username, username dot match. You can use regex expression over there. Oh no. Understood. A final script. Oh please. Let's equal to false. Copy paste. That's regex expression is for alphabet character only. That's why I will add. So this is the text, please. Enter puppet characters only. You can add multiple events or switch from the not an issue. So I'll copy this block. Street. That is for email ID. Mm. Name, email, email ID. This one. Go up email ID is enter email ID. Other regex expression I will add that is copy 
the path here and that is the field i just cut mail id and long digit expression is that that i have to getting from here this cannot be remember this text is done there is a digit expression for if you have added normal text instead of email so it will prevent so that's why this digits expression you can get the digits expression different kind of digits expression let's script digits is complement digits expression difference This site you can get multiple site of regex expression for validation purpose. JavaScript this is so character assertion, many things are there. For email, I have found this thing. Where I'll be there. Okay, I have it. So for mobile number, what I'll do? Copy. name mobile number that this name should be checked here i'm clicking this name fields name mobile number that is false and errors mobile number is interior mobile number. Copy this field, this line, only this line is required, yes. And the mobile number, I'll paste here. And that is your mobile number. And if, and the fields. Your mobile number dot match well over zero minus nine ten dollar slash. Valid copy paste just copy valid text last will is password of password that name i have to check mobile password go here password. 
register your password and copy this line first here first here first build password there is a long logic and also the password match also be required uh, i have this thing for a minute password match the field re-execution then get all oh, hellos are done and inside this function what I'll do actual thing Last function, then I'll do this dot with errors that will be errors. Then you have to return your form is valid. Return form is valid. So that is my validated form, this logic. Now, one more thing inside that trigger, I have to just check. This dot form is validated, it's late. And just add the object one by one. Username that is username field. And we call it a copy. Two, three, four. Email ID. Mobile number. Password. Now this dot set state fields equal to that field so to assign the field here. Mm -hmm. to move on alert box that will be form submitted. Form submitted, just checking. Purpose. Let's run. I don't know what will be the output, but you can see first messages are coming, right? So it should be red. color mm. error message error message color i have to set go to the style 
dot error message that color was change bottom will be set Let's check it on seven. Good press. Now, help put on name. Console is going to one minute. One, two, four. Oof. Type text. Um, Zero four input Is that okay? I'm getting driven to something public. Let's build the state dot dot name. Charts are coming, but uh, when I put something, that time
object object not log is it of hello ones Um, okay. Any further problem? Okay, I have to check it away. I don't think something is missing, but it is working. 
Let's check and I will update in the in the group. Okay, this thing something is missing. Let find out that value or kind of things is missing. Okay, hello. If yes, thanks. Yes, I, I will update it. Okay, in the some value is missing. I cannot find out. Currently, but is uh, that validation is working but only taking the value in the handle change that is something is problem that will get back to you shortly okay okay fine thanks hmm. uh, i will update the file okay not any okay after completing then i will update this file in the server and it drive okay thank you hmm. 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 okay bye okay bye bye mm -hmm. thank you Thank you.